Hey everyone, it's me, Kira. Um, long time no see. Haven't recorded a video in forever, but I have one for you now. Um, I'm gonna be doing a flip through of my bullet journal through all of November since it's now December. Um, I will not be doing a December plan with me because um, I already planned out December. I'm impatient and totally forgot about my YouTube channel, so that's a thing. But let's get into it. Let's not look at that because that's my email address. This is my index. I fucked up right there, so I had to cross it out. And there's more index. Oh, by the way, my my bullet journal. Um, I got it from Michaels. It's the Artist Loft plant brand. So it's not like the technical bullet journal. This is my key. I don't really follow this very much. I use the task thing in the completed and migrated, but like other than that, you'll see like notes, but like this events and appointment. Yeah, I don't have events events and appointments. Oh my cat's walking on my ottoman that I'm recording on so it just shook the whole camera um yeah so then I have you are stronger than you think these stickers are out of are from a different journal planner that I had that I decided I didn't like and then there's a really shitty sun and then I fucked up on my year at a glance and put 2017 calendar for all of these and then wrote 2016 through 2017, and yeah, I just really fucked that up, so that's a fucking mess, but that's okay. This is my bill tracker. Keep track of if I pay my bills or not, and my social media tracker to see my page views on my blog. By the way, you should totally go check out my blog. I will link it in the description below. Um, I post um, just a bunch of creative crap like yarn shit probably book reviews too I just started up like a couple weeks ago so I don't have very many posts and then I have my, my Twitter my Instagram and my Pinterest that I'm tracking too because I would like to get more followers on those and then this is my November calendar as you can see I didn't ever use it <laughs> um, I had birthdays put in for my little sister and my uncle and my cat at my mom's house my paydays, Thanksgiving, and then a birthday party, and that was about it. Other than that, I didn't fucking use the calendar. So, um, that is not what my December one looks like now. But I will put up a video of my December one at the end of December. This was my first weekly spread. I fucked up on this one, too. <laughs> the lines were all crooked. I drew too many of them, and that was before I got my Uniball Signo pen or whatever it was, the white pen and I couldn't fix it so I just fucking washi taped it all and that and I also put happy thanksgiving when halloween was supposed to be I was just a fucking mess when I started this apparently and then these are my weekly spreads well not my weekly spreads my daily spreads um I have the days of the month on the side but I only I did to november the like for november and then realized that it was still fucking october for these two so I just wrote the date up in the corner and then that will be a continuing thread on through the rest of my bullet journal because I wanted it to match but now it just kind of looks like I'm fucking stupid so I blocked that part out and I have to-do list the weather track how much water I have like an extra little thing to like write down little stuff but I kind of just end up not using that and then I have best of the day worst of the day and you will see throughout like the bullet journal I slowly stop using this as well um then I have the next day kind of the same and put leaves up here for November fall and then I started oh then I had I squished it in here for Saturday and Sunday because you Saturday and Sunday they're supposed to be kind of like a chill day for me so I'm usually not as busy so I kind of like fucking shoved them in there and now it just looks crowded as shit but it's okay because it worked for me and then well I I also started NaNoWriMo. <laughs> I did NaNoWriMo for like a week and then I gave up. Oh, hi, cat. Can you? Okay. Oh, patches. Smooth you. Oh, he's coming back. Okay, and then this is my next weekly spread. This is what the other weekly spread was supposed to look like. There's a cat tail in the shot. I'm so sorry. This is what the other, this is what the weekly spread was originally supposed to look like. This is what it's supposed to look like when you don't fuck up. And then more dailies. They start kind of start to get bare. I stopped tracking the weather as much and filling this out as much. 
I fucked up on the numbers over here, as you can see, so I put wash tape over it and then put an arrow at what day it's supposed to be because I'm really bad at fucking doing that apparently. And then the more started using this to keep track of like school work stuff and like when I had work. Um, and then like the best and the worst of the day, I kind of dropped off on those. I didn't really like it because I'm kind of a negative person when it comes to a lot of stuff, so it was very easy for me to fill out the worst of the day. Oh, there's there's the other cat. Hi, Fergus. It was very easy for me to fill out the worst of the day, but it was hard for me to fill out the best of the day, and I had to very much rack my brain for it. Fergus, what are you doing? <laughs> You're... <laughs> what are you doing? Come here. Perfect. Okay. Thank you. And then, here's Friday. Saturday and Sunday. Fucked up on the numbers over there again. Oh, I ordered my Micron pens. That was exciting. Because I had these other pens that my grandma had got me for Christmas like two years before, but the label had completely like rubbed off of them. I didn't know what they were or anything. So I just got new I got new pens. And then I changed my weekly layout to this. So I could put in when I had school and work and I could very much visually see how much open time I had. And then I had like tasks in next week put in and I had I was tracking my sleep because I'm I've had bouts of not sleeping, like insomnia, and then bouts of sleeping too much, so I'm trying to track my sleep and make sure I get, like, the right amount of sleep I'm supposed to get, because I know if I get, like, eight hours of sleep, I'm perfect throughout the whole day, and I'm, it's great. And then I was tracking if I was writing and tracking my sleep and drinking water, and I fucking failed on writing for NaNoWriMo. I'm pretty sure I dropped off at this point and stopped writing for it. Um, and then here you can see I didn't fill out the best of the day, kind of stopped using this box, my little clouds and my weather got really shitty. I'm pretty sure I filled these out, like, way after these days were actually gone. Like, I didn't put the clouds in there or whatever. Um, then, last day of classes for this day. And then, continue to track the weather. Best of the day is not in. Fill out the worst of the day, again, because really good at that. Um, continue to try to fill it out. I continue trying to use these. Didn't fill out the worst of the day. Um, I'm trying to stay positive. Uh, I fucked up on here. School ended this this day, so I didn't have school either one of these days. So that wasn't supposed to be there. Tracked my sleep again, didn't write, fucking, didn't track my sleep. Technically I filled it in later on in the week. Used this part pretty much. And then, sticking with the same daily layout, not filling in the worst of the day, was just trying to fill in the best of the day, try to keep positive. Um, wasn't drinking as much water as I probably should have. And then, oh, this was, I went back home. So I I moved, I live in Nebraska now, but my all my family lives in Iowa. So I went back home this day, and then this day was Thanksgiving, as you can see. So, like, I didn't fucking use it because I didn't have, didn't really have any planning to do because I was going to, I was out of town and everything. So I put, like, a Happy Thanksgiving sticker in here. And then, this was Black Friday. I worked like eight hours on that day and that was terrible. And then didn't fill out the best of the day. Worst of the day was just working because work got to be too much. Oh, and then here's my NaNoWriMo tracker. <laughs> um, I took this tracker from Boho Berry. I will link her account in the description. She is like my inspiration for any type of bullet journaling. Um, I fucking love her. This is the NaNoWriMo tracker that she thought up, well, last year, and then she added this part this year. And you can see I was really into it, and I was actually doing pretty good, and I was only behind by, like, a couple thousand words, and then I completely dropped off, and I didn't write at all the rest of the month. So, I plan on participating again next year, so if you want to add me on Nano on the NaNoWriMo website, I will be your buddy. I, will, I can link my thing in the description box below on that, too. Oh. And then this is a collection of songs I'm enjoying, and then this is Christmas lists, lists of presents for people. And then December starts. And then that's about it for that. And I won't show you any more of that. So thank you for watching my video. If you enjoy videos like these, please like and comment below. 
and um, tell me what else you would like to see me put in my bullet journal and stuff because I very much need suggestions for collections because right now it's just a shit ton of daily stuff and I want to have more fun lists and stuff in there. I have like one other collection in here that I'm using but other than that there's not much. So thank you for watching and come back next week. I was supposed to post this yesterday but it's coming up today so yep I fucking suck. Bye!